Welcome to Hunt for the One Cheesesteak Edition. Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome to this week's Hunt for the One. I'm Jeff. And I'm Paul. And today we're going to Tony Luke's. And uh, Tony Luke's is uh, one of the more known, well-known uh, cheesesteak places in Philadelphia. It is a franchise now. There's a bunch all over the place. They're in, in the stadium as well. And also, it's right by the stadium, the original one. And so a lot of times people like to go before games, after, after games. games yeah. Our one friend Josh, you, I think you guys seen him. He was in the back of a couple episodes. Yeah, yeah. So he likes going there. It's like one of his favorite places to go, even though he lives right next to Steve's. Um, but he uh, likes going there before games, after games, stuff like that. It is a uh, tradition for some people. So I, I mean, we're gonna go like always, check it out, tell you how it is, and uh, have a Let's good see time. See how it is. So we just got our uh, steaks after how long was the wait? Ten minutes. We wait ten minutes for the steaks. Uh, you know, a little bit longer than some places. But, um, you know, we're ready to dive in. It's a pretty nice day. There's uh, some good seating. And um, we're going to, you know, do the first bites. Like All right. So we're here at Tony Luke's. I obviously have the American. That's what we said on the ways. First, first bites. bites. And then we'll tell you about it. Oh, All of Joe's still um, doing him over really Pretty solid. Um, you know, like, like we always say, like, that's a good, we literally, after every cheesesteak, we say that's a good steak because we like cheesesteaks. So, um, mine was really cheesy off the first bite. Didn't taste the onions. Both, you know, like solid. There's like nothing like bringing it really far down. It's a little salty for me. I don't know if that's just me, but here, Joe. Um, I'll agree with everything you said. No one is on the first bite really good cheese. Um, I will say the meat, it doesn't taste like quality at all. I don't like the meat as much as normal, but yeah, overall, really so I'm not a big fan of Terry Luke's. I don't know what our friend Josh is thinking that much. All right, so um, we have a lot to say right now. Uh, Joe, you done, kick it off. Yeah, so we just got done Terry Luke's. Um, there is a parking lot here. There, there is, is a, a parking lot. There, there is. is also an ATM right there. We just walked past And a porta potty. And porta potty. <laughs> so that's the only good thing about this place. Do not come here. No, is, if you're looking for a cheesesteak. If you're steak, looking for a cheesesteak, don't come here. That's Because we were, we were dissecting the uh, cheesesteak while we're taking bites of it. We noticed it's just roast pork. It's roast pork. They put roast pork on it a cheesesteak. It, it was not good. The onions weren't good. The onions were salt. Like that's that's why I was the saying it's so salty. Okay, but they used I, they, they used the whiz that I don't like that much. But uh, overall, it was just it was not a good experience. It, I don't know how our friend likes this one so much. Yeah, it was um, it was really rough with the the roll on the whiz. It broke. Oh yeah, the the it was so like there was a good amount of cheese on there, yeah. so I can't say. It was just the taste was long, went right through. but it went straight through. The whole roll was yeah. the American. The roll held up a little better. I'll give it that. But honestly, it just don't. If you're especially if you're visiting, don't waste your time here. Yeah, go, go somewhere else. Like honestly, I would recommend Gino's or Pat's over here. Oh, 100%. and we're not even gonna go to Gino's and Pat's because it's a waste of time. One hundred percent. We like, wasted our time today. It was it was a bad day. Don't um, waste yours unless if you want to get a roast pork sandwich. They do it really well down here. I don't usually sh like. I don't think I've ever struggled as much eating a cheese and it wasn't because I was full or anything. It was just because it was a bad cheese thing. Yeah. It was uh, No, it I'm, was bad. I was right there with them. So that, that one took me longer than I've ever eaten a cheesesteak before. That was because I was just struggling to get it down. So uh, don't come here. Yeah. 